I'm James. I'm going to share with you a story about a Chinese Canadian. In the age of 70, he went back to his homeland, China, to start a new career to grow an organic farm. He started to do this because of in his recovery days of illness, he realized the importance of the organic food and for the farming needs in this homeland. So he went back to his home province in the county of Meizhou, Mei County. He started his organic farm business. In 2019 Chinese New Year time, I met this couple, Mr. and Mrs. Wang, in Meizhou. Meizhou is a hilly county. You can see that in Chinese New Year time, people is praying with drums. That means good luck in the temple. And the seniors are singing in the park. They learn new songs for the new year. And at the front end of the river, there is a quiet small farm. The name of the farm, God's Garden, whole lab. Mr. Wang and Mrs. Wang start the business in the age of 70. They sell their house in Scarborough and bring the money to buy this farm. So I'm curious, I asked Mr. Wang, why you start this organic farming business? He tried to start the organic farming because he see how the people in China eating a lot of inorganic products and many of the vegetables and the poultry are raised with a lot of antibiotics that is harmful to the health so that they try to start from the new idea to raise an uh, animal to raise the piglet ducklings and in an organic way so when he start he met a lot of problem he told me that i go to pray to my god in the time of nearly close to giving up god encouraged them so that they overcome the difficulties just in their faith uh, mrs wang shared with me the story that when they raise the duckling they start from the very difficult species and those ducklings lay their eggs in the hilly uh, bushes that is so far away from the farm so that they nearly think that they have lost those ducklings they never see them again but one day the mother is back with a lot of baby and they, say, they start to learn that those ducklings like their home, those are the organic home, they love it so that they bring their baby back to the farm. That is interesting. When I say goodbye to Mr. and Mrs. Wang, people are still celebrating Chinese New Year. To millions of Chinese, Chinese New Year is a time to share the blessings for those who come back, for those who return home. Many of them learn new concepts and new technology, for example, the organic farming from Canada. Then they understand the importance, that is the organic food is important to their health, important to their meal, and importance to the land that can grow more products which the inorganic cannot do this. While some of them are successful in their foreign land, for example Canada, but some are failed. They don't have chance to come home. But Mr. Wang and Mrs. Wang is among for the, those who are successful and they love their homeland. They bring the knowledge home 
and share with the local people. For most of the seniors, it's a time to enjoy life, the singing in the park. But for Mr. Wong and Mrs. Wong, they want to contribute to the piece of land they love.